How George Clooney Grew His Billion Dollar Tequila Business George Clooney, the legendary actor, makes a lot of money from his movies and through his numerous business interests. The thought process behind introducing their tequila brand by longtime friends George Clooney, Rondé Gerber, and Mike Meldman is entertaining. Clooney and Gerber came up with the concept of creating their own brand of tequila. In this day and age, celebrity-owned and celebrity-endorsed tequila brands are not uncommon. There appears to be an unexpected spike in the number of celebrities venturing into the alcohol market. Some of these labels are worth every penny including George Clooney's Casamigos Tequila, which is among the most expensive in the world. According to several websites, Clooney's Casamigos is one of the best-tasting tequilas currently available on the market. Hello everyone and welcome to another video on our channel. In today's video, we'll be telling you how George Clooney grew his billion-dollar tequila business. Yeah, you heard it right, so let's get started with our video. Casamigos is a tequila firm co-founded by George Clooney, an American actor and filmmaker, and his friends in 2013. Clooney founded the tequila company with property developer Mike Meldman and nightlife entrepreneur Rondé Gerber in 2013. Longtime friends Gerber and Clooney founded the company intending to create tequila drinks based on their personal preferences and for their own consumption. The two didn't intend to make the company public when they were forming it. Casamigos is derived from the Spanish terms casa, home, and amigos, friends, and therefore Casamigos means house of friends. While Clooney and Gerber were vacationing in Mexico, they came up with the idea for Casamigos. Clooney was the one who suggests they make their own tequila drink while they were staying at their house in Mexico. Their goal was to design a tequila cocktail that would be consumed throughout the day without causing a severe hangover. Clooney and Gerber did a lot of research to develop the optimal mix. In one of his interviews, Gerber revealed that they never intended to make money out of it. They only wanted a tequila drink they could enjoy. He added that they merely wanted to manufacture the best tequila because they didn't require any financial assistance. And as a result, they made the tequila as affordable as possible. The company was considered one of the fastest growing tequila brands globally, even though it was founded by chance. The duo has launched their tequila trip. They have conducted extensive research, met with numerous distillers, tasted numerous samples, and conducted blind taste tests with their family and friends to find the appropriate recipe for their brand. Before creating the Casamigos blend, the two of them tasted over 700 different samples. After determining the optimal blend for their tequila brand, they visited with a United States distributor interested in carrying their product. After much deliberation, they finally decided to start their tequila company with the assistance of their well-connected buddy, Mike Meldman, who later became their business partner. Meldman's abilities in marketing and catering to the high-end market have contributed to their company's growth and success. Gerber praised Meldman for being brilliant and having a slew of fantastic contacts that enabled their brand to flourish. To go with their unfussy bottle, they've utilized a straightforward stick-on label and a simple cork to close it up. The fact that Clooney's name is associated with the brand has contributed to the brand's rapid rise in popularity among consumers through word of mouth. They began by selling Blanco tequila, Reposado tequila, and Anajo tequila, with prices ranging from $20 to $115 a bottle, depending on the size. From 38,000 bottles sold in 2014 to 80,000 bottles sold in 2015, the brand has more than doubled its sales volume. Gerber feels that they all made equal contributions to its success, and he's right. While Gerber was the company's president, Meldman was in charge of marketing, and Clooney was actively involved in the company, paying frequent visits to the facility. The company the company's success was recognized by the multinational beverage corporation Diageo, who made an offer to purchase the company. Casamigos was acquired by Diageo in June 2017 for around $1 billion, four years after it was founded and launched. Although Clooney didn't feature in a single film in 2018, the acquisition of the tequila company he was involved with helped him become the most paid actor in the world in 2018. Diageo offered to pay approximately $700 million for the company and an additional $300 million continued on the tequila's performance over the next 10 years. The agreement reached between Diageo and the three friends resulted in Diageo paying approximately $500 for each bottle of Casamigos liqueur. Clooney expressed his pride in the company, stating that when they first established their tequila brand, they had no idea that they were on their way to developing a billion-dollar enterprise. Clooney believes that Diageo's billion-dollar offer demonstrates their confidence in the company's potential and that they had faith in Diageo. Clooney stated that they are still very much active in the business to this day, if not more so. Today, the brand has sold a million cases of their tequila brand, which was first introduced in 2006.
Well, that's all for today's video. Tell us in the comment section how today's video was. I hope that you found this one interesting. If you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing. And don't forget to provide us with your valuable feedback. We'll see you in the next video with some more amazing, luxurious facts and stories. And until then, stay tuned.